Baba Boy. Alright, welcome everyone. Today we're gonna talk about Todoroki. Man, like, you know, he was once very popular. I mean, like, yeah, I mean, now he's not as popular. I, I like, have not seen a single Todoroki in, like, the dungeons I was doing, like, at all. <laughs> It's so sad, but like, yeah, that's why I want to say, you know, let's use the moves. So the first move, it would be Ice Wall. I mean, it's not that, it's not really that far. And it does like 1.2k. That's, that's pretty good. And then the beam attack, you know, the good old beam attack. Ah, uh, that also did like 2k. I think, yeah, 2k or something, you know, uh... Okay, firewall does burn damage and it's a AOE around you. No iframe though. Only iframe is your fourth move, which is fine, you know. Toroki doesn't have that much range though. Um, not sure how I feel about that. His second move is the highest range, but first and third move is like, I mean, it's pretty medium. I mean, it's alright, you know. And then for the last move, super big range, you know, and then you like do a Megumi ult basically so I mean I'm not sure how I feel about that the damage looks pretty balanced so far you know the nothing is too broken you know I would assume like firewall would do a lot cause like it leaves a trail of like burning fire you know so that's cool at least not sure what to say about it man they have so many beam attacks in this game man like Megumi has a beam attack Saber has a beam attack who else has a beam attack um Rimuru kind of has a beam attack, but like it's like a different model, so it's technically different, you know. Um, but yeah, the the expensive character, a lot of them have beam attacks, crazy. But yeah, anyways, uh, let's head on into the dungeon. I'm not sure what else to say, you know. Very neutral about Toroki so far. I mean, I'll probably like, I like him, like. I see he's not like anything over over to the top. I would say like he's like a A for me, you know? Like a A tier if I had to put him on the list somewhere. So I mean nothing like that holds him back, right? Like firewall. You stay still but that's like one second or barely one second. And a beam attack, I'm, I'm sure you can snipe some monster with that. So that's that. Um let's head into a dungeon. Alright, we're here. Wait, why does the dungeon look different? And the music's different. Uh, okay. Alright, the first move doesn't one-shot. That's like about like most moves, you know? For like all the characters. The first move- Ooh, three is really nice. Yo, that one-shot. Hey, yo, that's pretty good. Like, it's like instant too, right? Instead of like a beam attack where you have to like charge up kind of, you know? Something like that, you know? Um, okay, third move is- I mean, it gave me a good impression, kinda. So. I'm not sure if the fourth move is very reliable, though. Because you, like, charge up a little bit, then, like, hit in front. Your enemy could, like, just approach you already, right? You know? So that's kinda spooky. Yeah, number three, man. That does a lot of damage. Too bad it's, like, 12 seconds, I believe. And yeah, it's not crazy. The third move is always, like, about 10 seconds long. So. I mean, it's fine, it's fine. We should live. Hopefully I didn't mute my mic. <laughs> Last time I did, okay, I didn't. That's very nice. We don't have to restart this. But yeah, one is really fast attack, you know? I mean, it doesn't stop you from moving. I guess it's like better for like bosses, just to chip down its HP, you know? And then third move, way clears really well. Like, boop. Does it kill the, the big guys? It does kill the big guys, okay. Fair. So you can save some cooldown technically. Huh. But yeah, I have like level 26 cards if you're new here, you know, and don't know like what I have. So yeah, I mean like basically like the end game gear currently is what I have. And I'm doing the nightmare dungeon, of course, you know. Gotta go the maximum difficulty. But yeah, Toroki. Really Pretty nice, you know. The playstyle is like a little bit different. You like semi engage and like try to use your range attack, right? Firewall, you gotta <laughs> go up close, obviously. And then, like, you know, the second move, 
You have to stay from a distance. Like, first move is like medium range. I guess like you use it whenever like you swap in between close range, long range maybe. I'm not sure. I am not sure. Let's gather them up. We can just end them like this. Pretty nice. But yeah, I'm not gonna pro I probably won't use my old old move that much, you know? Like it's really big range, but if you're fighting a moving target, you're basically gonna miss, you know what I mean? Okay. <laughs> he missed all of them. Imagine. Yeah, I really like that third move. The fact that I like stay still, you know? Have like a burn effect afterward. Helps out a lot. I wish they had like more fire, like burn effect, poison, you know, doesn't matter, you know, something like that. That would be really nice. And then like transformation would be nice too. Like actual transformation, like, because most of the transformation we got right now, hmm, it's like, it's like a buff more than like a transformation, you know what I mean? There's a difference, you know, you get buff and transformation, I feel like. Oh, wait, did he get one shot? By like number four? Looks like we got a legendary, I mean not legendary, but we did get a character. And then like, wow. Okay, I cleared it in three minutes. That's a little bit faster than before. I mean, with Saber and Megumi. I mean, I, I mean, it's probably because, I don't know, actually, that's really close to four minutes. But when I use Saber and Megumi, I had to like, you know, similar time, a little bit higher. Todoroki did a little bit better, you know, for me. Yeah, I mean, Todoroki, he could be an A+, plus, honestly. But, but that really depends, like, what dungeon we get next. For now, he's still, like, an A, in my opinion. It, like, like first move, right? It doesn't one-shot. So that's literally every single character. The first move, the only thing super unique that I like is the firewall, you know? As a burn effect, hey, that's fog, you know. And then beam attack, god damn it, beam attack. I owe you. There's, there's too many beam attack, you know. <laughs> you know, I like to see some circle, please, instead of like, um. Well, what shape do you call this? The beam attack? I don't know. I guess a beam shape? I mean, I'm sick of seeing it, you know. Like, I, I'd rather have like Rimuru's, like, Gluttony. Like, I believe Gluttony is like, um. Tornado, but like sideways, you know, if you don't know how that looks like, so Yeah, I mean I, something like that more unique, you know, that would be cool, but yeah Toroki is really good. I mean like he's definitely not bad or like below for me, you know personally like, I don't see how in the future that he could like struggle Right, you know, so seems pretty universal, you know, would a good would be a good pick if you like Toroki even though like his popularity kind of fell but yeah, anyways guys, thank you for watching, you guys have a good day, I'm gonna head out, bye bye.